Good evening, everyone. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Myra, and I'm Gary's best friend. Today, I'm also her maid of honor, which I'm really happy about that. Thank you, my friend, for giving me the chance and for choosing me to be your maid of honor. Um, I want to start by saying thank you, everyone. I hope you're having a great time in this beautiful celebration. Thank you for being part of it. Um, and I would like to share with you a little bit of how Carrie and I met each other. Uh, it was our first day of high school. You know, I had just moved to this country, so I didn't know anybody. And she, she had just changed from another school, so she didn't know anybody either. Um, there I was, sitting in the middle of English class, um, not knowing anybody, not wanting to talk to anybody because I didn't know what to say. And then this girl comes up to me and starts talking to me, introducing herself, and I'm just like, oh, I don't want to be rude, you know, but like, I don't speak English. Um, so she was completely understanding and she's like, don't worry about it. You know, Carrie, with her biggest smile, like everything is gonna be all right, I'm gonna help you. Um, she did. She did. Um, we our friendship is started by writing. She started writing, um, you know, little notes and stuff to me because it was easier for me to understand the writing. So I will just translate them with my dictionary all the time, and she will help me with the pronunciation. And here we are, 15 years from that day, just celebrating her happiness and her love, and. Um, I'm just glad she found a, a loving and caring husband. Um, the day that Carrie met Mr. Big, it was it was very special. It was just so different from any other any other day. She was just happy. Um, whenever she called me to talk to me about this amazing guy that she found at a concert, and she she was really excited. She like. This tall, handsome, um, interesting guy, and you know, like we were talking all during the concert, and he said he was gonna call me. I was like, okay, well, you got his number, and she's like, no, 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 but I gave him mine, so I really hope he calls. So I was like, okay, he'll probably call you, and so that happened. Next day, we went to a coffee shop. There we are, just drinking our coffee, and then she gets this phone call. I was like, oh phone call from a weird number and you know Carrie she never answers the phone for nobody if you don't if she doesn't know your number screw you she's not gonna answer the phone uh, but she took the chance and she did because she's like oh maybe it's Mr. Big so she answered the phone and I just know it was him because the way her face light up she was really excited she was really happy and so they agreed to go out on a date and there was another date after that and when I finally got to meet Mr. Big, like two weeks after the first date, I I just knew he was the one because of the way that he treated her, the way that he looked at her, and the way that she smiled every time that he looked at her. She she was just happy and she was in love and I was happy for my friend. Um, what else can I say that you guys don't know? I love you both dearly and I I want to tell you guys that you know um, marriage is not perfect but as long as you guys are perfect for each other and you guys work on everything together and the, there is communication um, there will be love uh, so everyone I just want to close this by uh, uh, making a toast to this beautiful amazing couple everyone raise your glass and join me to celebrate to celebrate my friend Carrie and her husband Mr. Big tonight uh, my God bless you all cheers